One of the congressmen quizzing Attorney General Loretta Lynch, Utah, Congressman Jason Chaffetz is here to go on the record. Good evening, sir. Hi, Greta. Did you get your answers? No, these are simple questions. Is it legal or illegal to share classified information with somebody without the security clearance? She couldn't say yes or no. It, it, come on, anybody. She could have. Why didn't she? Because she's playing this political game. I think she's being an obstructionist. I think it's the theater of the absurd. And I think the American people are fed up with it. You know, what's sort of interesting is that she said that she didn't, part, she didn't make the decision on the e email investigation. I thought to myself, why do we need an attorney general if the attorney general is not going to do a job? I mean, I, it was stunning to say she didn't make the decision. She wouldn't even own up to that. But she is the attorney general. She put it all on. On I, I don't get it. How did I she just... explain the uh, meeting on the tarmac with Bill Clinton on the Hunter plane? No, she didn't explain it. She didn't uh, give the vital details. It's a public meeting. I mean, if, if the attorney general is meeting somebody, there's actually supposed to be notes from that meeting. But she says they didn't talk about anything. And do you think she thinks she answered any questions? I think she's a professional at filibustering. I think that's why the Obama administration really likes her. And all you have to do is go back and, and watch, the, watch the videos of this, and you'll see that. I mean, I had five minutes. I asked her very basic, simple one-on-one -on -one questions, and she didn't answer one of them. So what's next? Well, I think the American public has got to, they get to be the ultimate jury in this. But um, she's not running for office. No. She's but, a presidential appointee. But as, uh, as one of my colleagues, uh, John Radcliffe, pointed out, she did not recuse herself from, she did not step back and say that she doesn't want to be part of the Clinton administration. To the contrary, I think prior she has said that she wants to be considered and she's got to be the leading candidate at this point, the way she's protecting the secretary. Would you like to have Eric Holder back? <laughs> the, the good old days of Eric Holder and the candor that we get from Eric Holder. It was, he was much, I mean, he was miles better than Loretta Lynch. That's how bad it is. She wouldn't answer one question. I mean, no. and you know the thing that's sort of always, look, she knew those were going to be the questions. I mean, she, I mean, you would at least come prepared with something. If I had asked her if it's legal or, is it legal or illegal to drive 80 miles an hour in a 55 zone, I think she would have... She couldn't have answered that she, because she doesn't want to. She's just a professional at filling up the time. She was looking at her watch. And go back and watch her YouTube video on my, on my Facebook page or, page or go to Jason in the House on my Twitter account, and you can link it. It's just watch and it, let people decide for themselves. You know, it's, it's, actually, it's an embarrassment. It, it really well, is. You know, it's, unfortunately, it's a very important job. And, you know, and it was, so it was stunning that she wouldn't answer the question, or at least have enough sense knowing that these are the questions that can be answered instead of giving that lame We talk about has. classified information. This information is so classified that as a member of Congress, as the chairman of the Oversight Committee, I can't even see it. It's, we're talking about people's lives. We're talking about people who will get killed if they see this information. And we talk about it so flippantly, well, and she'll say, well, you know, it's a hypothetical. No, it's not. It's well, we, people's lives. Well, I hope the viewers stick around for my off the record. I talk about the language extremely careless versus uh, uh, the language that uh, they say is in the statute. Gross negligence. Gross negligence, yes. anyway. Yeah. Congressman, thank you. Nice to thank see you. you. And right now we are awaiting Donald Trump's rally in Indiana. We are also getting closer to Trump's